University of San Diego's Grant Forrest has had a golf club in his hands for as long as he can remember. My dad took up the game when, um, when I was about four or five and I just tagged along with him to the driving range and golf course. The Scotland native soon realized that the golf course would always call to him and was lucky enough that he could easily answer that call. We actually lived on the golf course. We could just kind of sneak out of our back, back garden and onto the course kind of whenever we want. As he grew older, Forrest realized that because both school and golf were important to him, his best path to success was in the United States. Back home, it's, it's one or the other, I feel like. You know, you go to school or a lot of people still leave high school and then try and make it as a golfer and it's tough to make it and a lot of guys are kind of left stranded if they're not good enough so I feel like the U.S. is the college programs are just the best way to combine both. Leaving home took a leap of faith but the University of San Diego with its strength in golf, academics and all that sunshine captured his heart even though all he knew about the actual town was inspired by Hollywood. I'd only seen it on Anchorman and that was about it so it's probably not the the, the most realistic. I visited a few places which had good academics as well, but when I visited here, it was the only place I got a feeling I'd love to live here for four years. Forrest has thrived in San Diego, winning the individual honors at the 2013 West Coast Conference Golf Championships. But he has gone through some very hard times as well. In 2012, Forrest's father passed away just before he was set to compete in the Scottish Amateur, a tournament that he would go on to win with his dad in his heart the entire time. I wasn't really trying too hard, I was kind of my mind was elsewhere but kind of getting onto the golf course took my mind off that and um, ended up, I played well and had a good week and ended up coming out on top. He, he was, him and my mum were my biggest support growing up and especially him, he was always watching me at golf tournaments and traveling with me and stuff so you know I just want to keep keep making, making him proud. It is with his father in mind that Forrest continues to be inspired. Last summer he qualified for the British Open, an experience that was invaluable to a young golfer. The guys are just, they're so relaxed, like most of them anyway, they're, and they're, they're just human beings, like when you see them on the TV, you know, and then you walk past them in person, they're, they're still just people, you know. A lot of the things they do, it's the same, they're the same as the same as uh, college golfers. They're just a bit, a bit better, you know, and just um, trying to learn learn from them. Just a junior in college, the future is wide open for Forrest, and his dreams are sky high. I'm not quite sure what what route I'm going to take in the pro game yet, but um, I have to still have to figure all that out. And then obviously want to compete in the majors and European or PGA Tour someday. For the W.TV, I'm Amanda Blackwell.